What was the Tehran Conference? The Tehran Conference was the first of three strategic meetings between the USA, Britain and the Soviet Union to discuss Nazi Germany and how to end the war. Those who attended were President Franklin D. Roosevelt of the United States, General Secretary Joseph Stalin of the USSR and Prime Minister Winston Churchill of the United Kingdom. The conference was held at the Soviet Union's embassy in Tehran, Iran. It was held from November to December 1943. The Tehran Conference was important for three main reasons. It led to a better relationship between the USA, Britain, and the USSR. They were working together to defeat Nazi Germany, fascist Italy and Imperial Japan, and they also discussed plans for the UN and ending the war. Five important decisions were made at the Tehran Conference. It was decided the USA and Britain would open a second front by invading Europe through Nazi-occupied France. The USSR would invade Nazi Germany from the east. The USSR would invade Japan once Nazi Germany was defeated. The Polish border would be moved to the west, so Poland would gain territory from Germany and lose it to the USSR from the east. An organization would be created to settle international disagreements once the war was over. This would eventually become the United Nations. There were two key signs of tension at the Tehran Conference. Churchill wanted the Second Front to be opened up in the Balkans, not in France. Roosevelt viewed Britain's colonialism as a greater threat than communism.